we are gonna learn how you can make raining cloud in flash using micromedia flash professional 8 so just go right into it and to show you how you can make so you have to take uh, another stage where you can perform something and now you have to import some photos like file import and import stage you have to go and click over there and then click on the image you want and then you have to resize it uh, whatever you want to make a larger or smaller and the next step make sure that you already have download cloud photo because in next layer you have to some you have to need some of the cloud photo which has no background like this one I downloaded from Google writing cloud PNG you can also do the same and then click and as we have done with the background you also have to resize the cloud make sure it will be just size down you can also press F uh, you can also press shift key to make sure that it will be exactly the same you want and it will not really mess up all the image so it really easy to do now we have the image of cloud and the image of background so if you want more than just one cloud then you can copy and then paste but if you don't want to mess up in all then you can just press alt key and you have to drag it so it will be two or how many you want but in case if you are using macbook pro or any other uh, Apple's computer then you have to click option rather than alt like this we have done with the cloud so the next step is you have to do is press control alt control F8 if you are using any uh, computer or PC computer who has separate uh, keyboard but if you are you are using any macbook pro or any laptop then you have to click ctrl fn and f8 so it will look like the same now you have to name it anything like raining or whatever click enter now you are impo uh, you are now on a new screen and you have to make here rain so first step i want here is to drag some of the background because I want to align that where I want drain and you also have to make sure that you have resized it so it will be not like mess up all around the stage uh, so as you can see I am trying to make the perfect side that I want and in next step you have to insert another layer and make sure these both colors should be white because uh, like I want white rain uh, so now you have to select line tool from the toolbox and press shift and you have to make rain all over the don't mess up and don't try to make rain all over the photo just a single thin layer don't bother about if you are not trying to really just you have to not mess up and not Drain or make drain closer to uh, every single drop. Like you have to cover, not to mess up. Just like that. And the next step is we have to cl uh, you have to click on the another frame of second layer, uh, just like that. And below you have to click F5 or function Fn F5 if you are using any laptop. And you can just also click insert frame if you are not interested using shortcuts and the next step you have to click on the last frame of second layer so all the drop will be selected and you have to just cursor down from the key on your keyboard or you can just click over here and then drop but if you use cursor key on keyboard then it will be really easy and you will get the exact same alignment you want so just like that not too much and then you have to make here motion twin and that's all uh, we have done and you now you can just delete the first layer because we uh, make this just to make sure that our rain is being poured on the same spot we want and now we have to move on the first screen just like that and 
because we want rain uh, on the on the uh, on the background and behind the clouds so make sure your rain should be between both of the layers so that's why we I am clicking on the last layer and then inserting so my layer should be arrived between both of them and now I have to make sure where my movie is so here is my movie name is raining so I have to click and drag to the stage and but one more thing is we have to do because one layer will not be sufficient so we have to make uh, like four or five so it will be really good so now you have to click another keyframe or you can just mouse you can use mouse and insert keyframe and below you have to click just uh, F5 or function F5 or you can just use mouse to insert frame and here and what I'm talking about to make more than one layer for raining is just to make it as real so click on the middle layer and then press insert key so here you have arrived and now you have to click insert keyframe again you have to drag your raining movie and leave on the stage and then make sure and one one thing you may have to make sure that you have some space between the raining because first rain is start from here then second should be around here because there should be a little bit time not everything start from one place and and on the same place so if you do the same as I have then it will be awesome and if you want more than one then you can just click over here and make sure that you have lots of rain so it will be natural and then you have to do the same procedure what I have done like some rain and then make here keyframe I think three is enough if you want more then you can add but I am just trying to show you how you can do you can you want then you can but make sure one more thing is to have sure that your last layer and your uh, top of the layer which was for cloud and for background make sure they are all ending at the same place where your raining is so if you can just click one click and then another click on the same spot then you can see that is now selected and you can just drag it to the last uh, here so now your cloud is here and if you don't want to drag then you can just click and then you can add frame so your background will be appear over here and now everything I have done and if you do then you also have done everything so now everything is finished you can just press ctrl plus enter and you will get the result like this here is raining so it is easy see you in next video bye bye